Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to insert, update, delete records using a store processor in Oracle database. So at here I am using Oracle SQL developer and currently working on Escort schema. So at here I am using the table EMPR. So this is the record insert EMPR. So at here if you want to see the data type, so just write DLC and here the table name EMPR. Now let's execute that. So, see at your ID is not null, number tab, name, city, that's a bracket two tab. Now, here after the first is, so this is for insert operation here, this is insert operation. So, going to create the procedure for insert EMP. So, at your E underscore ID, so EMPR dot ID and here tab. So, ID tab is the number, so here E underscore ID is the number tab here. So, dot name so name is the vacuum 2 so add here that will create e underscore name vacuum 2 here after is et so cd is the vacuum 2 so here it's create e underscore cd is the vacuum 2 tab now here after is begin and here insert into so here so insert into emp here id name and city so whatever the value of ID name city so this will go to the corresponding ID name and city here after that to the commit operation so let's execute here so first I'm going to refresh the procedure so there is no nothing inside procedure folder so create that so procedure insert EMP it's a created here now let's refresh that so insert EMP uh, procedure is created now next is for update so add here create or replace processor update emp so so empr dot id so id is the number tab here so that here that is the input tab input tab input tab so i in indicate input input here so here id is the so e underscore id that is number tab e underscore name e underscore city bracket 2 because name and city is the tab of bracket 2 so next part is is begin here update EMPR. So set ID equal to E underscore ID. So here where condition I used. So if ID, ID value is dev equal to E underscore ID. So if this condition is match, then that will do add here update. So here um, E underscore name that go to name, E underscore city that go to city. Here after commit operation. So let's execute this query to create one procedure with the name update emp so procedure is created now refresh that so here this is the update emp it's created now here after the next part is so here create or replace and here after next is for select so add a create or replace procedure select emp and here or selecting emp EMPL only so add your EMPL input tab and your E underscore disk output tab and your this ref cursor so here and here is begin so E underscore disk for select so it will select ID name CT from EMPL and this is the condition name equal to E underscore name now let's uh, get the procedure with the name uh, select EMP now here after the next is for delete create or replace procedure delete so if at here id equal to e underscore id so if this condition is match then that will do the delete operation and here e underscore id i have taken only so here id is the number tab so that e underscore id is the number tab it will take from empl dot id percent tab so let's execute this query so compile successfully now here after uh, all procedure is created for insert, update, delete, and select. So first, I'm going to insert the record. So let's uh, see at here the table EMP. So this is the record here. Now let's uh, click on insert and run. And here after going to insert the name. So let's so at here input. So this is the input input time. Yeah, it's written. Now uh, let's so. Uh, give at your third round and your name is it is the handle now click on ok so act here now here after execute this query so see at your 32 round and honey value inserted successfully 
Now the next part is for update. So let's uh, click on run and after going to update. So if the ID is match, so let's uh, give add here. So 16 and here it name. So going to update the name. So Ryan already exit. So here going to give the name Sam. And here the city of Sam city of Perth. Okay, now click on OK. Now here after uh, check the execute this or table. So see at here Sam and city also changed ID 16. Now here after the next operation is delete. So run the delete operation. So at here going to delete to uh, 32. Okay, so just uh, enter at here input value 32 only. Now click on OK. So here it's completely successful. Now here after execute this query. So see at here 32 it's a deleted. So this is the query at here to insert update delete records using a store procedure. So I created different stores procedure for insert here for or select update and delete. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.